us to see. All right, um, we're in the process, I told you a couple of times before, but the guy that is gonna help us mount our projectors on both sides, he has had just one thing after another. Let us pray for Brother Tim, amen. His father passed away, and then after his father passed away, you know, dealing with that and trying to uh, solve estates and all that kind of stuff, and then he got very sick and went into a stroke, and it's just one thing after another. So we have not forgotten about our need to, to mount some things up here. But we want to see God make a way in our lives. We want to see God set us up so that we can worship him. So that the songs of Zion and the word of God can be visual for us. The reason that we're doing that is that everybody has a lot of kind of Bibles and things. Is that all right? Amen. If you are, I mean, you know, they got all kinds of Bible and when we read, we want to be able to read the King James Version because that's the version that I use um, so that we can, you know, all have the same thought and the same words. As I say that, however, I want to let all of you all that are technocrats out there, you know, that we do have internet service here. And so if you need to, you know, get on your iPad or Whatever you need to do, we want you to be able to, to do so, all right? Amen. We want you to stay connected. Amen. Turn to your neighbor and say, stay connected. <laughs> it is such a bad habit for preachers to get to the point of telling people what to say. But when you look out there and everybody just looking at you so blank, it is so easy to try to get them involved, you know? Um, but.